Let's go. Let's take it. 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 <laughs> oh, that's nice. Look at this. Baskets are in and they're fucking awesome. Nice little cane baskets. Just here? Yeah. There's a, um, a blind getting made up. Oh, shit, yeah. So it goes in here. Yeah, yep. Yeah. And then the, there's, you know, a little track comes down either side. This is all going to be black. Yeah, yeah. Black. And this is going to be like a, um, a sunshade screen. I get you. Down. So in other words, when you um in in bed, you can pull the show screen down here, and um, but so mossies don't get you. And then, but you can still have the doors open. And... Yeah. Yeah, that seems a good idea. Yeah. So when's that coming? That's pretty um, cool. I've already ordered it. They're gonna make it, so it'll probably end up being yeah. You know, so if not tomorrow, next week. Oh wow, shit yeah. yeah. So we're gonna test the solar. <laughs> so I've got the, got the solar way. Let's pull him out. Oh, awesome. So, uh, this one here. Yeah, yep. Yeah. That's cool. Load on, load off. Yeah, yeah. Load, short circuit. Alright, so we've got that one there. But this one here, LVD. Awesome. And this was just from my local JCAR electronics store. Alright, let's have a look. Plug this goes there, plug it in, and you got solar power. Will it blow the van up? Or no, not? No. 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 I think we've got it 50-50. Yeah, 50-50. <laughs> so, solar's in, we're walking up to the van, we're having a look. Is it charging? So Wayne just took the front seat out of the van so we can test the solar. So before the solar reaches the battery, we have a fuse, and we are just checking the bolts we get uh, with the voltmeter before we hook it up straight to the battery. So we're getting between 11 and 14 volts, as it's a really cloudy day and it's a little bit shaded. Uh, you need about 13.6 volts to be able to charge the battery. And I think we're just a little bit below that. Down there he's just about to plug in the solar. So the solar's unplugged? Yep. So now the solar is connected to the battery and Wayne's just going to plug in the Anderson plug and see if it works. So we're getting about 13 volts. Uh, not enough to charge it but it's working so we're happy and we'll test it out another day when we've got heaps of sun and it's not super cloudy. Why ain't you happy mate? Fucking excited. <laughs> Fucking well, works, got we solar. got the solar power going. <laughs> yes. I'm now off, off grid. Fucking beauty. Fully <laughs> off. So this is the solar power we got. 120 watts, foldable, it's awesome. Comes with this plug, Anderson plug. We've got the other end on the van so we chuck this out in the sun and then we get this plug, plug it into the van. So Wayne, why did we go for uh, the one you chuck out instead of the roof mount? Because uh, if you park under a tree, you uh, you have the problem type of thing about the shade, uh, the shade blocking it. So what's the point of you know, having it on the roof where you can park under a tree and chuck this thing in the sun? Exactly right. So the idea is when it's 42 degrees, uh, it gets hot in Dubbo, um, you don't want to have to park in the sun to charge your panels up if they're on the roof. So this way, uh, we can park under a tree in the cool and then just run this long lead out into the sun. So it's perfect. There we go, blinds are in. <laughs> Awesome. How's it work? Show us how it works, Wayne. I oh, do <laughs> What we do, we've got our up and down cords inside here like such. Cool Trends put all this up. Yeah, yeah, okay. Cool Trends is um, when, I, when I'm business in Dubbo, so I constantly use business in Dubbo all the time. 
you pull the cord type of thing, it goes down, like such. So they built all this, and it's inside this, um... Yeah. Runs through here. Runs through there with the, what do you call it, the channel, right? Yeah, yep. And then, uh... You know, like it stops out the mozzies. Actually, when it's closed off top, I think it stops out the heat from coming through the windows as well. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's, a, it's a cool sort of thing, otherwise. And it still lets the light through, so you got plenty yeah. of... See what's There's happening. plenty of light and everything else. That's real, it's no drama. Awesome, and then it goes up here. And I covered in the top of it, pushed a bit of timber up here so I then to go on top. Yep. And then uh, to close it all up, screw it all in. That's cool. Well, I'll have a look from the inside. No yeah, so there's a the cord. You pull it either way or the way and pull it down. Close it up. Close it up. That's cool. Pull it up. So you can leave it at any height you want, type of thing, and if you don't want to be seen, but you want cool air to come through, and plus the cool air still start, comes through this as well. Yeah, that's cool. There's no dramas about that. And then you got a board. You got a piece of. You put a piece of wood up top too yeah, to yeah. finish him off. To finish him off. The light comes through. Still have a bit of light through. No, no breeze. No mosquitoes. That's a big deal. Yeah. I need to hate mosquitoes. What about a price? Do you know a rough price on this? This was around about 340, I think it was. Oh wow! Yeah. So it wasn't too expensive for yeah, no, what it's it is. Yeah, right. It's yeah. I was quite happy with it. 340 dollars, and um, you know, and it was you know professionally done. So. Yeah, yeah. So that's it for today, guys. Uh, it's pretty much finished for the van. <laughs> we're gonna do a big finale video. We're gonna have drone shots. We're gonna have a. It's gonna be crazy. It's gonna be good. And we've got a few little secrets that we haven't showed you yet. But we're gonna wait for the big finale video. Uh, also coming up, we're gonna do a Q and A video. So if you have any questions, just let me know in the comments below. Thanks. Thank you. <laughs> so if you want to see more of the van, please subscribe.